it is very real. I, I used to procrastinate because why would I pay thousands of dollars to get rejected here when I can get rejected for free in America? <laughs> but I'm sitting here with Dave. How you doing, Dave? Good, how you doing? doing, doing not too bad, not too bad. We're winding down. We only got a couple of days left of the tour. Dave here actually did both tours. What made you um, decide to go? Just more opportunity to meet more women and actually meet friends here on the tour and get to see more of the country. Okay. And Dave, I mean, I'm sure you had expectations before the tour, and now that the tour is coming to an, um, completion, what is the difference between your expectations and actually going on the tour? I tried to keep my expectations low, um, just history in America, you know, and I actually, my expectations were massively exceeded. It's been an incredible tour, massively exceeded. Nice, nice. In what way? If you don't mind. Um, getting to meet beautiful women at the social, uh, and then a lot of them, Go on. <laughs> a lot of them will, uh, you know, you get to meet them at the social, and then several will go out at night for after parties and dinners and clubs and just amazing people. Now you tried dating in America, obviously, like the rest of us. What do you think the difference is there? Uh, here, when the women say they actually want to get to know you first, they mean it. Uh, in America, I get dismissed all the time before they even get to know me. Here, I'm getting to go on dates with eights, nines, and tens, and they genuinely mean it when they want to know me rather than what I, what I look like. Okay. All right. And you made some good connections? Amazing connections. You know, there's guys out there who are procrastinating about coming over. I'm sure you were one of them at one point. Yes. We all were. Um, I mean, if you could tell these guys who are watching right now who have been procrastinating about whether or not they should come over, whether or not it's real, that's one big thing. What would you say to them? Um, it is very real. I, I used to procrastinate because why would I pay thousands of dollars to get rejected here when I can get rejected for free in America? <laughs> but um, you don't get rejected here. They, it's worth it. It's worth the money. It's worth the time. Um, it's worth the effort because, like Joe was saying, there's genuine connections. Um, if you're if you come here and you want a family, you want children, you're stable financially, you're gold. They'll, they'll go after you. They will pursue you. And what about the people who, especially people back in America who say these women are not real. They don't really want a relationship. They only want the green card. They're very real. Um, I, I don't think I've met a true green card searcher. And from what I've been told, it takes three years. So that's a lot of effort for just a green card. And it's not just that, you know? I mean, I've been coming over for years. Yeah. And, the, and I've seen, like, you know, a lot of the same women, they're still searching. And it's because, I mean, they, they want a real relationship. Right. You would yeah. think if that's all they wanted, just the green card, they would have attached themselves to the first guy, yeah. got on over there, and they'd, have, they'd be living in America now with the green card. But it's not what they want. That's exactly. No. They'll pursue you, but you at the same time have to earn it. Exactly, exactly. But Dave, you've been a gentleman. Thank you. We've had a lot of fun. We have. <laughs> a lot of inside jokes now. <laughs> a lot of inside jokes, you know? And that's another thing. It's not just the relationships with the girls, it's the relationship with the guys that you bond with on these tours. Oh yeah, there's a, a couple guys that I've become really good friends with. Uh, one guy from Germany, and we're already planning an Oktoberfest tour next year, so. <laughs> It's just talking about Chris. Chris, yeah, you meet great guys on the tour and even better women and 
it's just a good time. It's well worth the money. Just, it is. just do it. <laughs> At the end of the day, it's a great vacation. It is a great vacation. But Dave, I want to thank you. Thank you, you know. too. No. So guys, if you're if you're out there procrastinating, you got to stop it. <clears throat> Get on the plane, okay? But if you've been sitting there for years or even months procrastinating whether or not to go over, stop it right now. Do it. Okay. Um, it is worth it, definitely worth it. But I hope to see you guys. Looking for your ideal bride? Check out our website at anewbride.com. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Then click on the notice bell to get notified every time we add something new.